Well, what is going on guys? Back with another video and the match I've just watched against Birmingham City was absolutely shocking and we deserve relegation. We might as well announce it because that was very poor from the lads. Tactically all wrong, couldn't score for our lives, strikers shouldn't be playing because Windass and Patterson up top aren't a duo. I think Reach and bloody, uh, what's his called, Rhodes should have played today. It was all around shocking. I think Rhodes looked the best player as soon as he came on for them, only like two minutes or something he was coming on. He looked the best player, he had his chance, he missed, well, great save from the keeper. It was shocking all around. Just announced relegation. I think Liam Shaw, piss off, back, go to Celtic already. Had enough of him. Reckless challenges every time. Might have hyped him up at the beginning, but now he's showing his true colours or is is just all round shocking with his reckless tackles. Every week he does it. It might not have been another yellow this week, but he does it week in, week out with his reckless challenges. We could have won that game against Brentford if he didn't get red red carded. And we could have won this game, but I don't think the players had it in him to win this game. It was all round shocking. I'm just very disappointed. We could have won this game. We could have got out the relegation zone, I believe. But now we're stuck in it. And I think we're stuck in it forever now. I don't think we're going to get out anytime soon. Unless we get some good results. But just don't see that happening. With that team today, shocking. Dunkley was very poor. He didn't have one of his best games at all. The defence as a whole was shocking. Westwood had some decent saves, but... Didn't really have to do anything, but when he did come up, he did save us quite a bit, but it was just just very poor from the lads. I've never seen a set of players like this in a Wednesday shirt that just don't seem bothered. It's kind of it's kind of pathetic from the players really. We're gonna have League One trips to bloody Blackpool, Portsmouth and that, so be looking forward to that next season. Wages on the players are going to be ridiculous for League One unless we have some relegation clauses on the contract, but I don't think we had that in plan at all. It's just all around going to be shocking. The financial, uh, like the financial all round the club is going to be shocking, and I don't think, I don't think we'll recover for a while. I think we'll be in League One for a bit. I don't think we'll get instant promotion at all. I think we'll stay there like a bit of a Sunderland, but I think we'll leave, be even worse than Sunderland at this point. <sighs> Serious changes need to happen around the club. It's just shocking as a whole. But at least the league one prices will be cheaper. Season ticket, but knowing Chad's era, it'll still charge us bloody Premiership season ticket prices and shirts. Shirts are ridiculously priced now. Season tickets, ad tickets as a whole are over overpriced. I think some something needs to happen. I don't know whether it needs to be an owner change or just someone that needs to advise Chad Zeri and how to actually run a club for once. But League One, <laughs> we're coming for it. And all the other Yorkshire teams are going to banter us because we deserve it at this point because we're absolutely shocking. Chad Zeri has to book his ideas up now because this club's going to be rud to ground soon with his advisors. He's in Thailand. He can't really do anything with the club. No fans aren't helping. I mean, there's no money coming into the club, so that's just going to just backfire on us. Uh, that's every club, though, to be fair. <sighs> just don't have any excuses for the lads. They're all poor, aren't they? The strikers today, Wing Windass should be a striker. Patterson offered some it, but not a lot. And then, phew, just didn't have anything in the game, I don't think. Bannon had a couple of attempts that he could have scored. All round, just, just very bad. I just don't see us coming out of this mess now. But we've put ourselves in it, so we're the only ones to blame. Well, the players are. They say that they're going to try to stick together and get us out, but <laughs> I don't think that's ever going to happen. Unless we do something magical. I don't see us getting a result at Brentford at all. It's just going to go from there. Just depends if all the other teams are losing points. But that's it. 
that's all I've got to say, really. That was all around poor, shocking, shite, whatever you call it. That was us today. But, yeah, that's all my thoughts on today's match. Well, today's match had the future of our club, but we've just got to support them, haven't we? Even if they're in League One, Championship, whatever, we we'll still have to back the boys. Uh, and I think that's it for today's video. Got all my points across. Just absolute life. Ang well not angry, just disappointed. Yeah, that's it. And as always, see you to the next one. Bye.